Hi friend, welcome back to my channel. Good morning from Nishita. In today's video, I am going to share with you how to become a teacher in Saudi Arabia. What are the qualities you required? Many of my friends were asking about this. So I submit this video to all those friends. So first, how to become a teacher in Saudi Arabia? For female teachers who are in Saudi Arabia under dependent visa or permanent visa. It means they have, so the first one you should have permanent visa. It means with ikama, you must have the ikama. You should have an ikama. So listen, visit visa teachers cannot work in Visit visa holidays cannot work in Saudi Arabia. So many friends asked, they are in, they are here on visit visa or Umrah visa. Can they go to the schools and apply and get visa? It's not easy in Saudi Arabia to get the visa, like when you are going with the visit visa or Umrah visa. Yes, but you can check with the school. They are having vacancies or no. But you must have an ikama to work in Saudi schools and companies everywhere. To work in Saudi, you need an ikama. So visit visa holders cannot work in Saudi. Hope it's clear. Then second, you must have attested your degrees from as attested degrees from Saudi or UAE embassy. Saudi or UAE Embassy attestation. Both are accepted in Saudi Arabia, in Saudi schools. So, I know you want to know which is good, which is easy to get, right? Yes. So, why people are choosing UAE attestation? UAE attestation, I recommend UAE Embassy attestation to those whose degrees are through distance education mode. Distance education mode or online degrees. Better you do that station through UAE Embassy and you no need any offer letter. No need offer letter to get a station. So distance education and online degrees you can attest. No need offer letter to get the attestation and it's very easy to get it's very easy you will get to you know the attestation within 15 days the cost is at present the cost is rupees 4500 hope you are clear ua distance education you can up you know Submit online degrees, no need offer letter to get attestation. Very easy, you will get the attested certificate in hand within 15 days. The cost is rupees 4,500 only. Why? Saudi Embassy attestation. Saudi attestation, your degrees must be regular degree. And it must be regular degree. They need offer letter. So, without offer letter, you cannot attest your certificates and it will take more days than your attestation, even the cost also, rupees around the rupees 15,000. So, to work in Saudi school, your attestation, you can do immediately and start your work. And later, you can do the Saudi embassy attestation. So, these three are must to work in Saudi schools under the family visa. So, once you are joined in the school, school will provide you Ajir license issued by ministry. For the Ajir license, you have to just give the translated, Arabic translated copy of, copy of your attested degrees. And school will give, you know, charge some amount on your 
Ajir license. So you can easily apply to the vacancies and give your demonstration and you can work in any schools. Hope all are clear like who are in Saudi Arabia. It's very easy if you have a tested certificate and ikama. One more time, I repeat, visit visa or Umrah visa holidays cannot work in Saudi Arabia. You don't have any work permit. Next, for male teachers and female teachers, those who are not in Saudi Arabia. So you can go through the website. Go through the website. I'll give you some website name, websites, job websites or school websites so some job websites are now Gulf, now Gulf, then byte.com and linkedin as you all know this is a professional linkedin is a professional platform for job seekers so you can apply through the LinkedIn. These are the options. So you can apply and you can submit your certificate copies and everything as per their requirement. And you give the online interview and demonstration. And you can join this way. Hope you all are clear with today's video. Next video, I'll be sharing about... Uh, what is the salary range of the like uh, different schools like uh, CBSC schools, IGCSC or IB schools and uh, what is the minimum and maximum salary details. So see you with another video. Thank you.